Well, hello everybody. This is Robin. I am Katahdin Cook and Mom's Homestead. I want to welcome each and every one of you to my channel. This is my Walgreens haul. Um, I got back yesterday from Florida. We were on vacation for a week and we arrived home last night and I had to do pickup this morning. So even though I'm tired and I had to stay up keeping my wood stove going because our furnace broke down, I had to go out and shop because I had to do two pickups for coupons because that's how I get my coupons. That's how I shop. So um, I will get some rest after I get these two videos out to you. I've got a Walgreens haul right here as well as a Walmart haul. I want to thank you all for watching. Please like this video. Please subscribe to this video so you will get the notification for my next video. I am a couponer and I shop for free. I get paid to shop. I roll points. I roll register rewards. I roll gift cards and into another transactions. I use this as a stockpile because I'm a prepper. Um, I'm preparing for any emergency and I teach others how to do this so you can get paid to shop you can have a stockpile you can trade barter sell if you want to have a yard sale in the summer you can put these things up you know half price even down to a quarter of the price and still get money back pay off your debt um, you can trade these items for wood water anything that you need or you can give them away which i donate occasionally and um, it's a tax write-off from my business as well as um, i donate to family so anyways, let's get into this. It is 3-8-2021, and it is Monday, and this is my Walgreens haul. And um, I had to spend 20, get 5,000 points. That means literally I have to spend the money out of my pocket in order to get back 5,000 points, which is $5, okay? But I also, when I was in Florida, I stopped at Walgreens to get two toothpaste and, um, I had gotten a Catalina. A Catalina is a coupon that spits out of the red box machine or the Catalina machine, and it's a seven off of 30. So I had to get my order to $30 and $20 for the spend 20, get 5,000 points. So I did a total of $30 in this order because there's some really good deals. Um, I wasn't sure what I was going to do because I didn't have all the coupons I didn't pick up from the week before. So I think they just threw them away and that was fine with me because vacation was more important. So this week with the Colgate, I have got this one here. They're $2.99 this week or $3.00, okay? You buy three, you're going to get a $5 register reward. This one was in clearance for $1.99. I used a dollar coupon. So that made it 99 cents. This one here was on clearance for 249. So that made it 149 and this one was 299. So that there is a total of $5 and 48 cents. Then you get back a $5 register reward. Well, mine didn't print and I'll explain that in a few minutes, but he gave me something for the fact that it didn't print out of the machine. Okay, also um, I had a dollar digital on this that came out so after that dollar digital it made it a 52 cent money maker okay so then i found these crafts i was looking for a certain ones and then i didn't see these they must have put them on the shelf when i walked away these are 6.99 this week i had a three dollar off one and i had a three dollar off this one so that made them 3.99 you're going to get back three dollars from ibotta if you don't know about ibotta join my team you'll get paid twenty dollars for submitting your first qualifying receipt, you can cash out at 20. So I'm not gonna say that you're gonna get 20 for doing one receipt, no. You have to get your order to 20, then you can cash out. So you get paid for all the rebates and they'll add $20 to your account for free And when you cash out. So I got $3 for this one, $3 for that one, makes them 99 cents, okay? These were thrown in because I had a couple of register rewards. I wanted to use the register rewards to spend down less money. So these are two for a dollar or 59 cents each. So that was two for a dollar. This week, the all is um, that there is 
288 I had a dollar digital. That is a load coupon. You have to go to your walgreens.com and put in your information or your number from, from your card or your phone number and you'll get digitals. You just load them prior to going. So that made that 188 okay? These hefty bags, this is a 40 count ultra strong. This is blackout. And I'm gonna give you the UPC code because some people like to look for that. So that there was on clearance for $2.49. And if you take a look at this, that's 40 bags for two forty-eight. dollars And um, these are the big ones, guys. So that is a good deal. So I found these pull-ups in clearance too. This was $1.29, I had a $2 coupon, he took it. That gave me 71 cents in overage. And I got back $2 from my bottom. So that made it a $2.71 money maker. Okay? So I got back $3 from my bottom for this, three for that, and two for that. But the Bic Soleil, um, you can print coupons on the Bic.com website and you'll take $3 off your purchase this week. These are buy one and you're gonna get one half off. Okay, so the first one for me is $6.49. The second one is $3.24. I didn't use any of them $3 coupons because I had a $5 load. It did not come off and I'll explain all that in a minute, but buying two of them is gonna get you $2 of Walgreens cash. That's added to your receipt and I will show that to you in a minute. But that's a total of $9.73. After the $2 Walgreen cash, that makes two raises for $7.73. And if you had the $3 coupons in each one of them, that would take off another six. And that would make it $1.73 for two raises. But the deal is even better. I had a $5 load, which did not come off. And that would have made it um, $2.73 for two of them. Okay? So after all said and done, There's the dollar for the Colgates and um, three for one crest. The other three did not come off and there's a dollar for my all. Then I used um, a $2 coupon for the pull-ups. I used two $1 coupons for the total, like I said. Um, I had a dollar off the all and I had Register rewards. And I had, I'm trying to think that three was not, the two was my coupon. And two of these twos are register rewards. And the third one, the three was a register reward. Okay. Then I paid $18.84 out of my pocket. Okay. I had to pay that in order to get back the 5,000 points. But after that, I had gotten back 14 points right there. See, my opening balance is what I have on my Walgreens account. That's not my register rewards, that's what I have on my account. And I got seven for doing the spend 30. I got five for doing spend 20. And I also got two for the big razors. So that gave me 14. If you deduct 14 from what I paid, that's $6.98, okay? Then he gave me, because the register reward did not print for the, the um, Colgate, he gave me $5 in points, okay? So, because I did not have the five that came off of the BIC or the three that came off one of my crests, he, he gave me $8 in coupons, but he said, I'm just gonna give you 10. So the deal even got better for me because that was $15 in coupons. After I deduct that off of what I paid, I paid $20.98, $14 in Walgreens cash I got back, so that made it $16.98. I got that $15 back for the, for the coupons, so that made my, my subtotal $198, and I got back $3 from my Ibotta for the razor. 
I got back two dollars from Huggies. I got six dollars for both of these Crest Brilliance and, um, toothpaste and ten cents for milk, but I did not get milk. I bought it, picked that up. So I got a total of eleven dollars back from my bought. So that made this That made this $9.22 money maker for all this good stuff. I got to take all this up home. I got to get paid to take it. I got the points back. And I got added points for the coupons that didn't that didn't come off my load to card. And I got $9.22 from my daughter. So this is my Walgreens haul. Thanks for watching and have a great day. I will talk to you in the next video. Talk to you later. Bye-bye.